Hi folks, how's it going? Welcome to another video. This is going to be a drunken vlog. It's Saturday night and I'm bloody drunk. And you know, I thought, you know, what's, what, what's better to do than stick on the camera and do a little vlog for you guys. So I've not actually uploaded a video on this Footwars 2005 channel for a week. It's been about a week. I've not uploaded a video since the, the open day. The, you know, saying that I'm nervous about the open day. And um, to be honest, guys, the open day was up. You know, it was totally different. You know, it was absolutely different to what I expected it to be. You know, I thought it was going to be like a whole group thing, and you know, it wasn't going to be too, you know, fantastic to be honest. But yeah, the open day was totally different to what I expected. Basically, what I did was I went in, uh, you know, spoke to people at like the reception bit, got a few papers to sign, which I, you know, I signed and stuff. You know, all my qualifications, previous experience, you know, previous experience, all that kind of stuff. And I got like a five to like eight minute interview. A really, really short interview. We just asked me some questions and stuff, you know. And uh, basically what happened after that was I left the place. I got an, a phone call the next day to tell me I got an interview. So what happened on Thursday night was basically at six o'clock, which is quite late you know, for an interview. It was 6 o'clock until 9 o'clock at night and it was one of those group interviews which I'm personally not a really big fan of. I don't like group interviews. But basically we were all in a group, we got interviewed, we got like a little tour of the place, you know, got shown what you had to do, you know, all that kind of stuff. And uh, basically after that we said to like, you know, before that we did like a little group activity, got to know each other, that kind of thing. Got a little tour of the place, got you know, signed a few papers, and basically that was it. I've not heard any word back yet, I'm I'm supposed to hear word back this week. This week starting at, it'll be the 15th, which is Monday the 15th of February. And uh, yeah, just see how it goes guys, you know, all I'm going to be doing is cleaning, you know, cleaning caravans. So, you know, it's not, it's not like one of the best jobs in the world, but you know, it's for me, it's, it's good, you know, it's a start. You know, I've done that kind of work at the community centre, which I've recently asked me to work two days next week, you know, at the community centre, which is absolutely fantastic. I really like working at the community centre, it's absolutely fantastic. You know, all I do is basically open the place, you know, clean the place, get, you know, get ready for all the different meetings, you know, set the tables up, you know, the way it's supposed to be set up. And uh, basically just take like half an hour to an hour walking up at night, you know, nine o'clock, half nine at night. You know, so they've asked me to do two weeks next week to cover for the, the current caretaker. You know, so that'll be, what, £7.50? No, £7.80 an hour. So, uh, basically three hours for Monday and three hours for Tuesday. So, you know, it's, it's you know, if it will help, you know, it's it's a bit of experience, you know. I like doing it. I like working the community centre. The community centre is awesome. You know, it's an easy job. You know, all you do is clean up, you know, just show people around, you know. If people are like lost, don't know, really know what room they're going to, just show them around, you know, I absolutely love that job. You know, to be honest, it's just a pity that, you know, the person that works here, that, you know, the permanent caretaker, you know, he's he's about 30 year old, you know, early 30s, I would say. So he's going to be there for quite a while, I think. He's been there for a while as it is, but he's going to be there for a while. He's a real, real nice man. You know, he was basically he was the guy that gave me like the training. You know, he basically showed me around, basically showed me what tasks, you know, what my responsibilities were. You know, he's a really, really cool guy. So, um, but he's gonna be there for a while. You know, he really likes that job as well. He just lives just across from the community center, so it's really, really handy for him as well. So, um, but yeah, he's an awesome guy. I couldn't ask for a better person, you know, to basically train me, you know, to show me my responsibilities. Really, really awesome guy. So yeah, because that is basically the, the basically the news on the job front. My bed keeps bloody creaking because it's not the best. It's a bit broken to be honest. It's yeah, I wouldn't say broken, just a bit creaky. Yeah, it's it's quite it's quite creaky uh, to be honest, as you can probably hear. So yeah, guys, I just thought I'd make this random vlog. It's a drunken vlog. I know I'm gonna be talking a whole lot of crap. You know, I, I do talk crap when I'm drunk. But I just want to really talk about a few different things on this channel. You know, I've not uploaded in a week, but I've got tons and tons of bloody quick reviews to do. You know, I've got a drawer of games in there that I've completed, that I've still to do a quick review on, you know. 
And I'm, yeah, I'm just a bit behind on it, you know, and uh, the quick reviews at the moment. But I will get back to you guys, I really, really will. I've completed games like Naughty Bear, Ridge Racer, Unbounded, Lollipop Chainsaw, which in my opinion is just absolutely fantastic. You know, not a 5 out of 10 like IGN says, it's a bloody good game, I loved it. It was short, sweet, it was bumming stupid, but it's got a charm about it. It's got some kind of charm that I really like. So I love Lollipop Chainsaw, ain't gonna lie. I've got games in there as well, like From Russia With Love. Got Far Cry 4 there, we've got Drive Club there. All games that I've completed that I've still to do a quick review on, but I will get I will get to it at some point, you know. It's they're there and they're in my drawer, ready to quick review. I just need to get around to you know giving them a good old quick review at some point. You know, because I think every game that I've completed, guys, I've enjoyed. You know, so I will do a quick review, definitely at some point. Uh, pick up video, not quite yet. I've only picked up two games, so I'm going to wait until I get maybe three or four games, maybe even five, before I do another pick up video. I've done quite a few pick up videos recently, so um, yeah, I'll just wait on that really. Uh, what else can I talk about, folks? What else can I talk about? Spiders! Yeah! You know, almost, you know, as you probably guys, you guys probably know, my videos. You know, a lot of my videos have been bloody like spider videos and talking about spiders, you know, in my vlogs and things. But um, obviously it's been like winter and stuff, but I've not seen a huge spider in like months. So, um, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. Those things freak me the hell out. So I'm not complaining, folks. I am definitely not complaining. I seen a spider the other night. It was hanging from a curtain. It was like... That big. You know? Just, I don't know, maybe 10 times bigger than a grain of sand. It was extremely small. It was hanging from a current there. So, um, that's the only real sighting I've had of a spider. I've not had any other signs of a spider. Obviously, it's winter. Probably spiders are like hibernating or something like that. I don't know. But, in my opinion, guys, they can stay the hell away. I'm sick of having spiders in my room, you know? And my room, my whole bloody house, not just my room, my whole bloody house. I'm sick of having spiders in my bloody house, in my living environment. But I've not had them for like, like say, months. So that's fantastic. You know, because, you know, if I, had, if I did have a big spider in my house, guys, you can guarantee I'd avoid a video by now. You know, because every time I see a spider, I just, every time I see a spider, I just automatically think... YouTube, get the bloody camera out and stick it on bloody YouTube. Because everyone just, everybody wants to see my big bloody spiders in my house, you know. So, um, yeah, it's been really quiet on the spider front. Like I say, not complaining. I absolutely hate spiders, so as far as I'm concerned, they can stay gone. But I know when the summer comes, when I get into like April or something, I know spiders are going to start coming in, they're going to start freaking me out, I'm going to start to make bloody YouTube videos of spiders ratting about them, raving about them and they're going to keep coming back and I can't do a damn thing about them that's the thing, that's the thing so anyway folks, yeah that is it for my little video I think for the little vlog yeah, a drunken vlog I don't know what I've bloody said half the time to be honest guys, I hope I've made my bloody points clear you know, I know I'm not the best at making videos when I'm drunk, I really shouldn't make videos when I'm drunk because I just don't bloody know what I'm saying half the time. Yeah, I'm going to upload this in the morning. I'm going to upload. I might even upload this tonight. And I'll look at it in the morning and be like, what the frigging hell was I talking about? You know? But anyway, folks, hope you've enjoyed this little video, guys. And I will catch you all in the next video. See you guys. Thanks for watching. And I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog.